I'm Jared Kalpin, director of tennis here at West Bay Beach and Golf Club. Today we're going to be talking about three different scenarios of switching sides, three different types of ways to do it right, three different types of ways to do it wrong, okay? Also with a bunch of communication involved with doing those switches, okay? All right, first scenario is going to be I'm going to hit a deep ball, then he's going to have a short ball, he's going to have to run over, cover that short ball, and then his partner's going to not be able to switch with him, okay? You're going to see the first way how to do it wrong. All right, ready guys? See what happened right there. There was zero communication. They're looking at each other. What's going on right there? The main thing right here is communicate. So that short ball goes over. This time, Doug is going to shout out, I got it switch. Ralph in the backcourt over there is going to say, I'm switching. And then he switches over. Okay, so let's see it done correctly this time. Ready, guys? Ready. Ball. I got it switch. I got it. And the lob. I got it. Right there, you see that lob goes up. Doug yells out, I got it. If he doesn't yell, I got it, Ralph starts to shift over there, thinking that he's got to go cover that lob now. Since Doug said, I got it, now Ralph knows he can stay over in position and be ready for the next side, okay? One more time, let's see it done right, guys, all right? Deep ball. I got it, switch. I'm switching. Yep. I got it. Great job. Okay. Great job. Okay, good guys, good. Second scenario, second scenario we're gonna do is a lob is gonna get hit over Doug's head, okay? Now, watch what Doug here does when he switches sides, okay? This is the wrong way to do it. Here we go. Yours. Oh, oh. oh yours. Uh. Yours, switch. <laughs> Okay, we keep going like this. We're going to pull out the defibrillator for Ralph. There's no way he's running back and forth all day like this. Do you see how tight onto the net that Doug was right there? If he's in that close to the net right there, there's no way that he's going to be able to help out and cover a lob. Okay? So what he's going to do is this time, lob's going to go over his head. He's going to switch to the other side, but he's going to back up as much as he can. So now he takes away that lob. Okay? All right, let's see it done right this time. Here we go, guys. Ready? Communicate. Oh, now Doug's ready right there, ready to cover that next lob. He just took it away, and he's saving his partner. His partner's not feeling like he has to run side to side all day long, okay? Let's listen to that communication one more time, all right? Ready, guys? Oh, we got to start over here. Let's see a regular cross-court ball first. So we're in the middle of a point. Your switch. Now they're ready to play some defense over there properly. See that great communication there from Doug. Yours, I'm switching, okay? Always want to hear that communication from you guys, okay? Okay, third scenario. We've got a gigantic gap in the middle that you can see right here, okay? So many times I see a cross-court ball hit right through this middle, okay? And then this person has to go cover it over there. Now let's see this one done wrong, okay? Ready. So, you saw right there, a ball goes to the middle, that deep person feels like they have to go shift over there, cover that ball, and now number one, there's no communication right there, okay? But so many times, it's easy if that ball goes through the middle for that net person just to slide over and cover the other side. All right, so let's see it done properly this time. Okay, let's do it correctly now, guys. Communicate. He's ready to cover over on that side, okay? So you see what we're talking about here. Communication is so, so, so important, especially when we're talking about that switching stuff. We see it all the time. It's two people are on the same side of the court in that I formation, okay? And they're not communicating properly so they can get in the proper sides of the court, okay? Thank you, guys.